What's going on guys? Welcome back. We got another pop haul. It's a pretty big one. I've actually already recorded this, but I accidentally deleted the video, which uh, it worked out pretty good because I actually picked up a few more after that. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get through this. We got kind of quite a few to go through. Um, so let's just let's just start at the top and work our way through. All right. So first up, I didn't even know this thing had a cut in the top of it till just now. That freaking sucks. Anyway. Hot Topic exclusive from Dragon Ball Super Series, number 260, pop animation. We got the Super Saiyan Rose Goku, Goku Black, Super Saiyan Rose. He's got his little, let's see if I can turn it so you can see. He's got his little Kai blade blast or whatever coming out of his hand. Very cool. Looks really good. Um, I do actually like the one that Sherry made me better because it's all metallic. It looks so much better, but this one's cool. It's got the little blade on his hand or whatever, so very cool. But I didn't notice till just now, it's got a freaking cut from the box cutter on the top of it. That sucks. Next up, we got a GameStop exclusive from Five Nights at Freddy, number 206. We have the Jack Ochica. It's probably actually going to be the last of uh, Five Nights at Freddy's pop that I get. Uh, they're just making way too many of the same thing. It's just over and over, different color variants or whatever. I'm just tired of it, so. Alright. Moving on from the pop movies line, had to pick this one up. It's number 55 from the pop movies. From the It movie, we got Pennywise. Had to get Pennywise. Uh, I know they're making a new one. Uh, probably definitely have to get it too, but it looks really cool. And I just, It's just one I've been putting off getting. I don't know why, but anyway, finally got it. All right. And then this one, I didn't actually plan on getting it. Uh, the box is messed up pretty bad, but... Um, I decided to go ahead and pick it up because I just watched the movie not too long ago and I really enjoyed it. So this is Hot Topic exclusive. It's actually the chase from one of their uh, mystery pops. So we got the masked Alex DeLarge. Very cool. Had to pick it up. Um, it's one of those things, you know, you just, I hadn't seen the movie and then finally got around to watching it and I really enjoyed it. It's one of those movies you're going to have to have a weird, uh, weird sense of taste for movies I guess to like it but anyway all right next up from the Walking Dead series number 154 we got the teddy bear girl zombie it's one of the most iconic zombies from the Walking Dead uh, it's where Rick you know is walking through the parking lot trying to find some gas and thinks he sees a little girl over there and walks over there and she's a zombie so I will say it was in like the first episode or like one of the first couple episodes anyway this is the one that I uh, picked up for Adeline that she actually wanted. Uh, I tried to get her to get the Walmart exclusive one, but she didn't want it. She wanted this one. So it's number 172 from the Pop Heroes line from Wonder Woman. This is Wonder Woman holding her sword and shield. So, yeah. I mean, it looks really cool. Uh, I mean, it probably looks better than the Walmart one. It's just the other one is exclusive. So she was happy to get that. This one I've had sitting around for a while. I was just... I don't know, I haven't done the haul, so anyway, number 227 from the pop, I didn't even put it on there, from the Marvel series, that's from the Spider-Man Homecoming, this is the GameStop exclusive glow-in-the-dark vulture, very cool looking, uh, I wasn't sure about getting the vulture until I seen this glow-in-the-dark one, I said, well, yeah, gotta get it, looks awesome. Next up is also a glow-in-the-dark pop. Number 449 from the Pop Movies lines from Lord of the Rings, a Hot Topic exclusive. We got the Glow in the Dark Twilight Ring Wraith. This looks, looks really awesome. It actually glows blue for the Glow in the Dark, but very cool. Had to pick that one up. Alright, next up, also from Hot Topic. This is from the Pop Marvels line. So I guess they don't put the Marvel under the Pop logo like they do on the I think pretty much everything else. Anyway, so number 234, Hot Topic exclusive, we got the Blue Venom. Had to get it. Love Venom. It's probably my favorite Marvel character, Venom and Carnage. I uh, love the Spider-Man uh, villains and stuff. So I believe this is supposed to be from like the Marvel vs. Capcom back in the day, and they made Venom, and he was actually blue on the game. So there you go, Blue Venom. Next up, 
number 528 from the pop television line this is a fye exclusive we got the dragon shield red ranger so i was lucky enough to snag that when it uh, came up for pre-order online and i actually found my buddy one uh just a couple days ago when i was winning fye so it worked out pretty good i uh, had to pick that one up nothing new on the back but yeah looks awesome All right, next up from the Pop Animation line, number 239 from Attack on Titan, a Hot Topic exclusive. We got Levi, but this is the cleaning Levi. Uh, I remember this in the show. It was so funny because um, Aaron and all of them, they go, uh, they join the scout regiment. And they, they think they're fixing to go train and do all this cool stuff. And then here comes Levi dressed up, you know, all decked out in his maid costume or whatever. And they had to clean the place where they were training at, so that was pretty funny. All right, sticking with the animation line. This is number two sixteen from Death Note. We got Light. Uh, the next few of these are gonna be from Death Note, so uh, we had to pick up Light. Oh, about dropped it. Then we got the regular L. That cobweb on there. Alright, so this is the regular L. He's just standing. We got the L with Cake when he's in his weird little seated position. They did such a great job of capturing this character. Uh, they even got like the darkness around his eyes and it's real pale looking. I mean, it's, it's perfect. You can look at that and you know that's uh, L. Alright. Probably the coolest one out of this line, number 217. We got Ryuk. He's the Shinigami. Um, holding his apple. Uh, it's one of his favorite little treats from the Earth Realm or whatever. Paint job's a little sloppy on it, but it looks really cool. Um, I hope they do the female um, Shinigami. That'd be awesome. Actually, they showed several of them in the show, so they could really do all of them. But never know with Funko. All right, moving along. Also from Lord of the Rings, number 444. This is Barnes & Noble exclusive. This is the clear... Frodo Baggins. So that thing is like super clear. You can't even really see it. Uh, it is such a good job. I mean, it looks so much better than the old clear ones. I think I got a Predator one that's clear. But this one is just like super clear. Looks really good. Alright. Last but definitely not least, from the Pop Marvel line, number 233, Walgreens exclusive, got the Superior Spider Man. That looks freaking cool. I have to admit, I don't know anything about the character, but I love Spider-Man, and this one just looks so cool. I had to pick it up. The black and red just looks awesome. It looks like the Iron Spider, but it's a different one. All right. So that is going to do it for this pop haul, guys. Uh, like I said, I'm going to start slowing down a lot more on this stuff. Uh just there's way too many to do and with san diego comic-con coming up i really gotta decide exactly what i want to do how i want to approach this because i don't want to end up spending two or three hundred dollars on pops that's just ridiculous so um we'll see how it goes and i'll let you guys know what i'll pick up let me know what you're looking forward to and i will see you guys in the next video bye